Hello everyone, so I could make it finally after one hour of driving my bike I could find a place to get to the water The problem with this lake is that it's around this lake whenever you drive whenever you search around this lake is, I'm not sure what's called it's a long, I think wheat spike or something like that it's very long and you can't get through to the water but after one hour of driving it's hard drive because the ground is so wet and it's so hard to drive here I could find a place finally without wheat spike I'm not sure if it's called wheat spike it, but it's so long and you can't go through and to find some water <laughs> finally so the reason that I came today on a cloudy uh, and dark sky because I wanted to make a very long exposure something like more than 30 seconds something like maybe one minute or two minutes so I will see right now I will read uh, how the camera I will read how the camera will give me the shutter speed and after that I will uh, uh, calculate how it will be if I will use my 10 stop ND filter so now I'm using f16 and the camera is telling me that my proper shutter speed is 1 15 of the second and that means one minute with 10 stop ND filter and if you don't know how to uh, calculate how to use uh, 10 stop ND filter easily you can find the link to my video here or here uh, I was talking about a program uh, called I think LEE F stopper or something like that you will find the link here and you can easily give this program that your shutter speed without ND filter is 1 15 of the second and uh, the program gives you the proper shutter speed with 10 stop ND filter or 6 stop ND filter or 15 I think 15 stop ND filter so I will put my ND filter and I will show you the photo right now without ND filter and after that with the ND filter so this is the photo without ND filter so the reason that I'm taking the photo high today and I didn't went uh, thief thief Deutsch no <laughs> and I didn't went down to the ground because I will show you now what I'm thinking about let's take the camera and recording a video here also so as you can see I'm taking uh, I was taking the photo something like that the top third of the photo is for the sky and the other the other two third for the lake and for, for the tree and I was taking the photo like that from the top because I don't want the branch if you, if you can see the end of the branch of the tree I don't want them to to touch the other side of the lake if I went down like that the end of the branch would be would uh, go through the other side of the lake and will touch the sky and I don't want like that I want uh, the tree to be isolated 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 I want the tree to be isolated and to be clean and the filter it's at home after driving one hour okay I have another plan maybe I will try to use my CBL filter he gives me something like one f-stop I don't know how I forgot my ND filter I forgot it I will try to with my CBL filter maybe he gives me just one f-stop something like one, th one second or something like that so this is the photo with my CBL filter I couldn't go more than one six of the second without having any highlights unfortunately I have to come here again I have to come here again if I could make it I will come here again tomorrow before making the video of the next Sunday or something like that so I will end the video right here and as I said if I could make it I will come back tomorrow and I will uh, try the both photos uh, the vertical and the horizontal photo with 
uh, ND filter and I will decide which one uh, I will like better. I will show you the both result, uh, the photos from today you have just seen and the photos from tomorrow, hopefully I could make it tomorrow and come here. Um, uh, the photos for tomorrow I will show you also and yeah I hope tomorrow will be also cloudy like today because I'm not sure tomorrow maybe yeah it's not so cloudy that's why maybe I will come uh, at the morning before sunrise sunrise something like 8 hour 8 hour 20 something like that 8 20 so I will try to come before sunrise so I will have a very long exposure more than I, I need something like more than one minute or something like that more than 30 seconds or more than one minute so I will have a very soft clouds and a very soft water unfortunately today is so good for an ND filter because as you can see it's windy and the water is moving so fast and with ND filter 10 stop ND filter the, the water will be so soft but bad things happen sometimes so thank you very much for watching and see you tomorrow hello everyone so today is tomorrow in yesterday's video and unfortunately there's no uh, there's no chance to go back to the lake and to take photos again with the ND filter because I didn't find it at all I searched in my old bag and in my new bag and I didn't find it at all I don't actually know where it is I'm thinking about that I I forgot it on the location in my uh, videos which I was talking about minim minimalism minimalism uh, because I didn't uh, use uh, the ND filter since that day and I searched a lot at home in my bags and unfortunately I didn't find it so I just want to say that I will not go, uh, go back to the lake I will not take uh, the photos again maybe I will do that when I become my new ND filter I have just bought a new one and I am waiting for the delivery to bring the new ND filter to me so thank you very much for watching this video uh, subscribe if you would and see you next video bye